Hello and welcome to the Run the Table tournament. It's currently my table. Jake is a guest at it. I stole it from Jolly. Jolly stole it from Joe's. This is Jake's second time playing Family Feud. You lost to Joe's. Yes. Uh, game of the century. Pick your team. Uh, you know what? We're going to be... Our team is going to be the... Uh, you know, I was really hoping and wishing we could be the... Mm, Bizats. I was, uh, I was happy to get that, the Bizats. I was thinking maybe... The Bizats. The Bizats. That's recording? Yes. Our faces? Yeah. We didn't like clap, should we clap? Solid clap. Um, the Bizats will be facing the re -recta. The Rectum. The Rectam. Rectam. They, like they have to correct everyone. <laughs> Nonstop. We are the Rectams. The Rectum family. No, we're the Rectam. Out of 100 people surveyed, the top four answers are on the board. Only four. This is a big one. Got to get it. Okay. Okay. Seemed like you were quick with the... I uh, just mashed. Name a place where you'd hate to be seated near a screaming baby. Mm. Mm-hmm. This is a good one. Did I spell it right? I think so. And really tidy. Wow. Oh, shit. You should have best be guessed better options. Restore. So, I mean, this is actually going to be nice because you, there's going to be two out of four taken, and you're going to play to get the next two. I guess so. Um place you'd hate to be near a screaming baby. Like, anywhere? To be seated, I think, is a key word. Seated. Yeah. And um, that's nice of me to help you out with that. I mean, I was reading. Dude, the first one that came to my mind, and you know it's somewhere I frequent, is church? Is that a good answer? We'll find out. Do babies cry in church? Uh, everyone does, I think. It's a very Name a place emotional you'd hate experience. to be seated. I cried in the church. Oh, uh, yeah. Two days ago. Holy shit. Wow. Jake. Great. I didn't... So we still have the number one option out there. That could have not been up there, and I would not have been shocked. Right? It could have been the number one, and I would have not been I'm shocked. I'm trying to think of places you sit. Restaurant, church, airplane. Where's places you sit, man? At a... At a game? Like, that's a really bad guess, though, and it feels super not specific. <laughs> a game. Uh, sports on your mind all the time. Oh, I mean, hey, would you have a good time if you were at a baseball game and there was a baby screaming right next to you? No. no. I'm going train. Okay. I'm not sure how popular trains were at the time, but it's kind of train, plane, automobile, like bus. It's not that. Okay. Okay. Bus, church, restaurant. Okay, I've got bus. That's like my only other guess. Place you'd be seated. Restaurant, church. Where else do you sit, man? I'm going bus. I don't feel good about it. I don't know. You got it? My only guess, and the seated part kind of doesn't matter. It's just a quiet, like a library. Just a quiet place Ooh, okay. where you wouldn't want noise. I see the angle. I think if people are under the clock and you go, you know, and, and they just infer it as you don't want noise. I'm worried that this is going to be a rude answer and it's going to be like anywhere. Yeah, how do... I'm very interested. Let's go, Congrats Rectams. Congrats to the Rectams. Oh. Um. Oh, okay. so, that's how bad. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> so the number one option then. Got it. 
How many hours per day do babies sleep? What, dude? <laughs> you might be more educated on this than me. Um, babies sleep a lot, right? That's the thing. Twelve. <laughs> Your path to the end bug is pretty good. Um, I'm playing. Eat bugs over there, dude. You're going to play? Yeah, dude. I love... One thing I love is when babies sleep. Around me. Dude, what are the answers here, bro? Can you tell me the answers? <laughs> I got a numbers one last time on with Jolly. Yeah. And uh, it was very obvious that... I, I, I wanted to pass, but it was like, I think these are going to... All the same number. I mean, should I be going lower or higher? Do babies not sleep? I thought babies sleep a lot. It's just like in periods. Do I, I ever remember when you were a baby? Dude, I remember nothing from babyhood. I mean, parents are always tired because they want their baby to sleep. Dude, I don't know, like six hours a day? Let's go five. Wow, it's a lot of, a lot left on the board. Yeah, I'm, I think the Byzats might have this. Well, I only get one shot. Do babies sleep a lot? It seems like they don't. Well, 12 was there, so I, I was just gonna play off 12 and go 13, and go but north. people don't like the number 13. Right. So then I'm just gonna go 14. Just I hope it's awesome. somewhere in there. Okay. I think you got it. I should have been going up, I think. Yeah, I was surprised when you went down. That's a, such a little sleep. And then you kept saying baby sleep a lot, though. Uh, but 18? then you were guessing. But you were guessing. Oh, yeah. The wrong guesses. But you were saying. I inverted the math. In <laughs> you were saying yeah. baby sleep a lot. And then you were guessing four and six and five. Honestly. Which is so little sleep. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, grandmas are up. Grand. You're still winning. Good. I have 100 people survey top four on the board. Name something <laughs> connected with the Civil War. Oh my God, slavery? Is that what they're doing here? It's spelled it wrong. I sure did. What's happening to my fingers? Clicks. And a really bad guess. Because it was people. Oh, I just straight up read it wrong? Yes. That's my bad. Um, That's my bad. What was it? Name people? Name someone connected. I read something. Thing. Good job by you not, connecting, not correcting me. I think Lincoln, right? Probably the number one. I mean, here's the thing. I'm going to run up against the wall here. Oh. Um, we're going to play. Um, and let's see how many generals I remember. Um, I'm going to guess Lee. Um, Robert, right? Okay. Okay. Um, I think this is going to suck because I'm blanking on the number one answer. Name someone connected with this war. I really botched it. Jefferson Davis. Remember that? I'm thinking that's four. I don't think that's going to Wow, matter. okay. How about that? They're really searching. Yeah. He was a patsy. No one cares about him. Um, Grant, is that the right time period? Doesn't seem like it. No, it's the number one. Did I get it? It's the number one answer, yeah. Oh, I thought I didn't get it. No, you got it. Yeah. Lincoln, Ulysses. Man, Ulysses. Ulysses, that's Grant. Um, like, is anyone named Jefferson back then? Do you think you have the fourth? No, the fourth can go a lot oh, of different okay. ways. Um, U.S. Why is it taking so long? So long. Um, 
the those are the three. Like, but the fourth can go, I, I think, a lot of different ways. Um, it depends which way that leaning. Like, were any Franklins around then? I don't think so. But oh, dude, there's definitely people named Franklin. In the there's Civil War. people named Franklin both ways, first and last. Yeah, <laughs> turtles. It doesn't feel right. This is big. You're yeah. my history guy. Yeah, I, I mean, I don't know which way they're going to go. Sherman, McClellan. I, I think Jackson, I think Stonewall Jackson Ooh. is is the next like most popularized name. But he died in the middle of it, so and he wasn't ever like a general. This is for the game. Nope. I wonder what it is. Wow. Taking a long time. Taking a long time. The wreck dams. That was huge. Sherman. Sherman. I said Sherman. Damn. Wow. Damn. That's a huge lead. You win. It's your table. Fuck. Um, if I stole Sherman, would I have won? Yes. I said it. Well, the first name out of your mouth. I don't really regret it. I. I'm in it. I'm, so when you so you I'm said Sherman, someone, then Jackson. Yeah. Who is the someone? McClellan. When you said Sherman and McClellan, I was like Sherman, big time. Then you said Jackson, and it was like ooh. <laughs> yeah. Well, McClellan was whatever. He was a general. Go so on. Like, for a while, he Grant basically rep, or uh, Grant replaced him. Okay. So if he wasn't so inept, right. It would have been Lee and McClellan's, like, the biggest names. Ingredients and Same. casseroles. Meat? Beef? You're my casserole I would have said too. meat, but... Name something little boys like that little girls don't. Balls. Sports. Sports, I guess. Which, again... Sexist. Dumb. And I don't want to answer that, but the game wants it. Name an occupation that uses a truck. Fire? Fireman? Yeah, milkman. Mailman. Um, how many different channels does your TV get? Say like 30. It's 1980. Dude, that feels high. I was going to say like 8. No, that's like 1960s. 20. That doesn't feel good. Doesn't feel good. It's probably like 5. <laughs> Damn, name an illness. An entire family might go on. <laughs> Measles. Chicken pox. I'll go measles, man. Cold. It's probably cold. It's probably cold or flu. I'll go flu. I'll go flu. It's I probably. like that. <laughs> measles felt a little dated. <laughs> measles felt mean, too. Our time frame felt a little off on measles. That was bad. What? That was good. What? I went with mail, man. Uh, hey, four points. <laughs> flu. <laughs> okay, we're back. We're back. Ingredients in a casserole. Meat? Yeah. What else would there be? Like peas? Little boys like that little girls don't. Um, construction? Like balls. Balls? <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite toy. Wrong um, boy. Name an occupation that uses truck. Driver. Mailman? Milkman? Mailman. Delivery. Clicking my face off. Uh, how many different channels? Five. I think five. I'm going three. Let's lowball it. Fuck these people. Name an illness an entire family might cold. catch. Is that different than a flu? Yeah, right? Yeah, cold and flu. Yeah. I don't think that one. Okay. <laughs> you have five zeros. Yeah, that's tough. <laughs> but you run the table, and you're up against Joe's again. God, let's go. Damn. See you there. Fuck. <laughs>